Hello, I'd like to talk about um, to Harmony of Dissonance. There's a little thing I want to show off that I haven't talked about at all because I was reminded this existed. It is Maxim mode. You enter Maxim. I don't think you have to beat the game. And I play as Maxim. It was pretty damn fast. And he can still dodge for some reason. Well, those are extremely similar animations. Also, he has an outline now. He attacks pretty fast. He's got a star instead of a sub weapon. He has this awkward looking slide move. But that's not all. He can double jump. And he can screw attack jump if you really feel like it. There's another move you can do, but I need to hold these up because they're kind of hard. Um, forward, back, down, attack. Why didn't he use that move on us? I guess he did technically use the derivative of it. Now I need to get about 50 hearts to show you off another thing. Also, Maxim doesn't have a menu. He just pauses. Oh wow, you get to see the boss room. Um, so yeah. In uh, Maxim mode, you don't have much. You don't have any items. You don't have any real special things. You have set stats. You don't level up. So consider it a bit of a level cap mode mixed in with... You have the best weapon, basically. I mean, what else other than the cross do you really want? You pretty much have a better version of the cross that has a little bit more range built into it. It's also pretty damn fast. Because they knew you didn't... You don't give a shit. Okay, let's see if I can pull this off. This is a healing move. Up, down... I'm pretty freaking bad at these moves. Ninja heal! Up, down, down, forward, forward. Or, as they say, up, uh, quarter circle. I, get, I don't know how quarter circles work. I'm sorry. Quarter circle DR? That might be it. I don't know. I don't have experience with fighting games. Mostly because I just... I, I lack the dexterity to really pull that off. So the only way to get anything is to get these things. There, there's really nothing else you could do with them. Because it doesn't level up. His stats are set in stone. I think it's an interesting concept. It's it's pretty damn cool that you have a character that's basically... Oh, you get everything? You're, you're fast, you're nimble, you're a ninja! Ha! But, at the same time, it basically means that it all comes down to skill gemins. Aw, oh, they give you a little heart for it. They're like, oh, you came? Aw, oh, well, sorry. No relic for you this time, Maxim. I still don't get this move. Apparently, it is the fastest attack in the game. What? I don't know what it is. It's just the slide animation, but... Ah. I like how there's a guy behind that painting. Yeah, he's pretty strong, but that's because... You need to be pretty strong to handle the last area. I don't know how Maxim Mode works, though. I don't know what your objective is. Let's see if we can find the first boss, and we'll beat the first boss, and then... We'll leave it at that. Maybe we'll try the Mirage Attack, and see how powerful that is. And then I'll do it legitimately, because, you know, I don't want to be a cheese ball. I'm sure the Mirage... Is... Wow. I don't remember him being that tough. So it's entirely possible that he kills enemies based on hits, and they're all based around his attack stats. I mean, look at how much damage I'm taking. Maybe he just had shit stats. He does not have shit stats. He's 191 defense, apparently. I don't know. 191, that's pretty close to what we had at the end of the game, isn't it? His strength's a bit lower, but yeah. Apparently has almost 80 luck. I actually kind of like his uh, noises. Hard up. Hard up! I do like the range of his attack, but apparently, here's the fun thing. Um, whereas the other guy gets a pretty good uh, back and f an up hit, he doesn't get as good a hitbox, which means that there's a little bit more finicking to get stuff done. Also, no mo no money drops. Oh, I thought there were no money drops because you don't spend money. I don't think the merchant is in this game, so... Uh, I, I said no money drops because that ch chandelier up there didn't drop anything, and I figured, okay, so it extends. What's with all these random hearts? 
Oh, we can sort of go here. Well, hey, we're gonna beat that uh, Cyclops boss after we see if we, how the bosses in this game work. I don't know, this guy, he, he feels really nice. He feels like an extension of, uh, because he can also, he has a lot more air control. He feels like an extension of good old-fashioned Zhusht. He is the logical extreme of having way more mobility, but being kind of frail, I'd say. Oh, there, I thought it was a bit slippery, but it isn't. Why would I have to do that? He's got the triple jump, man. Jesus Christ. Oh my goodness, it is an actual screw attack. Damn. Hard up! <laughs> I can see this guy being... Perfect for speedruns, considering his, he's just nimble, he's fast, he's on his feet. I think his dash is even faster. Just to, like, hammer it in. Like, oh, Zhush, Zhush fucking sucks. He sucks. Here you've got Maxim, who has moves that he probably should have used during the final boss fight. Oh, I see why he does that stupid kick thing, because his sword attack's way too pro. This does make save points so much more valuable. Then again, you, you probably use save points a lot anyway. So your bosses are like... Let's take a test hit. Oh wow, that's still pretty extreme. Let's see if I can pull off that move and see how that works. Because it's kind of hard. Maxi Mirage! Oh my god, that is a lot of damage. That's pretty good! Too bad it's kinda slow on its feet. Gonna bring it, boy? Think you can bring it? You think you got what it takes? Let's see what this move's like. Oh wow, that is a lot of da- Oh, it's a boomerang too! Oh, damn, Maxim! Why do you get all the cool toys? I mean, Juice got one attack that's special. You don't, although you don't get any spells. You get literally nothing. So, which it just makes it good. It's like, oh, you tried for five minutes, and then you're like, okay, I've, I've technically had the full experience, but... I do like that he has an outline, but why didn't he have that outline in the main game is the real question here. Also, his mirrored sprites are very similar, which, again... No, I have to know if he has an excellent, too. This is a question that will resound the ages. That will mystify families for years to come. I wonder how much his heal move does. Oh, it is full health. So for 50 hearts, you can essentially live a little bit longer. Too bad it's a pain to pull off. Yeah, D-pad on the Xbox 360 controller kind of sucks. Oh, he is a much top. Oh, cool. Can I get great? Yeah. Let's see. There's a little little gray dot in the center. I, I think that's supposed to be a reflection, but it doesn't make sense to me. I don't know. I like Maxim. I like how fast he is. He's fast and furious. Like everything about him feels fast and responsive and smooth. It's like why didn't this guy get a game? Because every single Castlevania pro protagonist is slow as fuck. Even Alucard! Alucard was slow, Nathan was slow, Simon was slow... Who else was slow? Um... Who's that other guy? Yeah, Just was slow, Shinoa was slow, Soma Cruz is slow. And then we get Max, who's like, yeah, I'm fast as fuck! Breaking speed records across the country. I'm Maxim Man. Maxim Man. 
Maxi Man! Maxi Man is going at the speed of lightning with a roar of thunder! Maxi Man! Okay, so I want to do one more thing before I go. Okay, so he does have an upswing. Okay, so he does hit things above him. Does he hit things behind him? Let's actually test this over here. Yeah, oh, wow, he is... So, you get incredibly high mobility, but in the return, you have to be very precise. I like his character. I like it. I don't know why they make more fast characters. There are technically, in most games, items that make you faster, but they're not great. I don't know why. This, the, the Castlevania game just really hates that. Oh, yeah, his, his kick move has a special effect. I forgot to mention that. I don't know why I'd have to do that, because he's already pretty fast as fuck. Oh, look at that. Look at that. You think, you think, you're, think you've got shit, boy? I have a boomerang! It looks like a giant shuriken. Yeah. Not gonna do this, though. Fun as it is, it is basically New Game Plus, but more boring because there's nothing to do other than New Game Plus around. So, hope you all enjoyed Max Mode. I don't know if you be have to beat the game. I'll probably put that in the description. No, but I look it up right now. I mean, I got the whole wiki out here. Might as well do the whole Game Facts with websites. Okay, let's see. Uh, boss. Oh, you can do boss rush mode. And then you can get Simon Belmont 8 bit mode. That probably plays like shit. Oh, it's in only in boss rush mode. Oh, once you've obtained. Let's give that a shot. Play as maximum boss rush mode with an RLR. Okay. Oh, you can actually activate hard mode with hard game. No magic stops from using spell books. That's fine. You don't need spell books. They're pretty good, but they're not required. Uh, okay, yeah, you have to beat the you have to beat the game. Let's uh, control. <sighs> Fucking hell, broke. Oh, that is... that is... probably broken. <laughs> there are probably some circumstances where this is fucking broken. Okay, um... How do you enter the Konami code? Okay, oh yeah, because... Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right... B8. <sighs> okay, um... <laughs> Are you fucking shitting me? Oh, that's how you get. Oh, this is so cool! It's a shitty little Belmont guy, and he doesn't have any dashes, he has nothing! He only has a little whip. Meet you with my little whip. Is that a unique one? That is a unique one, isn't it? Yeah, that is, that is not how most other characters do that. Wait, so... He has his own goddamn physics, doesn't he? Nope. Just with the thing. Let's give it a shot! Let's give 8-bit Salmon to 8-bit Belmont um, uh, his time in the sunshine. I've noticed... Uh, boss arenas are very similar. Oh my god, he is tough as nails. I guess because he has shitty motion. Oh my god, they even brought in the dedicated jumps. You know how in most games... Uh, the, even Juiced had some degree... Oh, you don't even see, You don't see damage. You don't see fucking damage. Oh! This is the most classic you can get. You've got dedicated jump arcs. You've got the... Oh, you even have the stupid, ridiculous acceleration. Oh, man. I think Simon Belmont's health is actually made after the health bar as it is in... I think he doesn't take any damage at all. What, what happens to Belmont, and what happens to his enemies, is he dishes out exactly the amount of damage he would in the original games. Meaning he has an exact amount of hits, and his enemies have an exact amount of hits. I want to do this. Oh, come on. Belmont deserves it. Ugh. It's a little bit hard, because his motion is slightly different. Oh, he doesn't get it. All oh, right. Yeah, you don't get to. Oh man, it's so cool. 
Do 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 Oh, look at little bomb on go! Oh, he's so cute! Oh, this is so awesome! He can jump! He can jump up! But you know, one thing I've noticed, he doesn't trip through stairs like a doofus. That's such a... Are you fucking shitting me? He stops on the He actually stops on the right steps on the way up and down. Do you have any idea how few games pull this off? There's so many fucking games where they can't get this right, and Simon Belmont, an 8-bit character, pulls it off! Flawless victory! I fought in multiple of you! With several Medusas around me, no less! Nya nya! Simon Belmont, quite the hero! I'm a hero, you're a zero. As in zero HP. Ha! Ah, not if I jump into your weapon! I get the feeling his cross is slightly faster, but that might just be all imagination. Since I get healed anyway, what the fuck does it matter? I'm just gonna whip you. I don't like that he has the fully upgraded whip. He should have had the leather whip. And then you pick up a couple of stupid items, like Konami Man and the Crown, and they're like, Oh man, I've got super whip. Yeah, let's call it a day. That's pretty freaking cool, man. Look at him go! Look at him go! Oh, wow, you just got hearts. I thought you got to switch items, but no, you just got hearts. Oh, this is the best. He does click to them, which is kind of bad, but... Oh, man. 8-Bit Belmont, you are better than... <laughs> just don't know. Oh, uh, even as the janky walking anime. Oh. I have no nostalgia for Castlevania for the NES. NES. Never played an NES. Never owned one. But, like, you can just smell this guy's got character. Look at how he pops. Because he's such an awkward bit sprite compared. Look at how painterly the background. He's like, nope. I'm uh, jogging on the stairs. See you guys next time. I'm going to fight me another boss. Do those squats, man! Bet you can't beat me because you don't do squats! Gotta do some squats, man! That's how you win! You squat and you whip them! You whip them and you flip them! Flip them like a pancake! Oh, he doesn't have a. Uh oh, I forgot. He doesn't have a dodge. He doesn't have a slide move at all. Ah, think he can beat me, boy? I'm Salmon motherfucking Belmont. OG. That kind of stuff. I like how he shoots his little arrows pointing like like the middle. No, Jim. Oh, is that specifically made so the Belmont doesn't fit? I don't know. I don't remember how the other sprites work. Flawless victory, fucking Belmont, man. You think you're your pro? You think you're champ? Keep getting his whip is much slower. There's, there's a significant delay between this and the one that Just uses, and Maxim especially, because Maxim's like, pew, pew. yeah, I, I just, this has been the, this is the best video of the entire goddamn series. Cause I'm way too much fun with a class character that doesn't fit the game at all, which just tells you the original Castlevania had it just right that he feels so good, even in a completely different game built around completely different mechanics. Though that's only probably going to count for the first two bosses. I'm actually Wraith Dracula's first form is probably very interesting. See you guys next time. Dropping the beat. Dropping that beat. Drop it, you good? Didn't drop the beat. No, you didn't. Going up the stairs. Going down the stairs. Look at my fine shoes, made of fine calf's leather. Also made of pig leather. Reinforced with steel, toed, tip toe.